could rock this with any of your outfit. It kind of go. The, come on, you guys, just think about it. Think about it. you guys really off this. <laughs> I can see these are some camel pants. Right? Yeah. Might be a little fire. <laughs> <My> little fire. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Welcome to a very, very, very special episode of Hype Talk. And like always, we got Big Boy Johnny. What it do? We got Tan Tang AK Puerto Rico. What up, y'all? And Sky Pilot is currently on doggy vacation. And today, we are going to be going over a bunch of upcoming sneaker releases. Mm -hmm. Got a lot of good ones. Y'all ready to talk about these? Let's, Let's go. go. All right, so first sneaker up, it is a batch of five sneakers presented by Adidas. It is uh, basically going along with the whole Marvel series and everything. Mm -hmm. So they put together one character for each basketball player, all okay, right? Okay, and these okay. will be debuting during the playoffs. There's some Hardens. You even got Damian Lillard as okay, a character. Okay, okay, okay. Right, let's, 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 let's take a look at these. Let's see, let's Bam. see. So these are the Harden. So wow. Harden was basically uh, Iron Man. You got Damien as Black Panther, T Mac kind of random as Nick Fury. <laughs> okay. You got a Captain OG America, style. Captain okay. America, John Wall, and then you also got Captain Marvel for Candace Parker. So wow. uh, that kind of makes sense for everybody. Does it make sense? Like, I don't yeah. know too much about Marvel. You guys seem to be you know, more. You, you know, Harden got the bag. He already got the bag. So it only for right, sure, you know, with sure. the red and the gold, it makes sense that that's a Rockets colorway. What I'm happy to see is that it doesn't have like a, a like a pay less type vibe. Like oh. it's not a picture of Iron Man yes. on it. It looks premium. I oh, mean, you only seen one sneaker so far. One sneaker. Oh, okay, okay, Let's okay. So one. far though, the Hardens, the Hardens look, look good. pretty good because you got the nice signature Iron Man, you know, colorway. All right, all right, all right, all right. Damian Lillard. This one definitely has uh, a little bit more of a subtle vibe. Again, mm -hmm. I like that they didn't put, you know, the Black, Black Panther, Panther yeah. mask on there or anything like that. So this one right here, obviously, you got the nice little little Wakanda technology. Yeah. yeah. Okay. 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 T Max. T Max. What character is he? That's classic. That's a classic Nick Fury. Uh, Leather jacket on with the little you iPad. Know, it's always fitting, you know. Nick Fury's old. T Mac, he's old. Oh, is that why they did that? It is. Yeah, I think that's why they did that. Yeah, they, they, it's all about the details with it this. It kind of makes right sense though. Everybody they're picking. John Walls, I definitely can't. Okay, this was Captain America, obviously. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It looks like know, even a, a sneaker Captain America himself would rock. It, you know it really I mean? does look like he would wear that <laughs> like, part It of looks the suit. like a, a movie prop. A lot of these, again, they're really, really <laughs> subtle. <laughs> But they don't really blend in with the Hardens. The Hardens are hard to Iron please, Man. please. I would man. say the Hardens are the standout. Let's For talk sure. about the Hardens. I like the indentation into the actual material of the sneaker. It definitely embodies the whole image of Iron Man. I yeah, like yeah, it. definitely. I like it. I like it. These right here, I say these are a cop. I'm going say, if you're a fan of Marvel. I think they did a great job on all of them, just because I do like the subtleness, and it still has the aspects of the superhero itself, but then also the player itself. Oh, so it's yeah, a nice yeah, little definitely. mashup between Hopefully, both. they make these for uh, for grade school. I mean, you got your favorite basketball player mixed in with your favorite Marvel character. Hey, man, we got grown ups that like Marvel, <laughs> too, That's what I'm man. saying. All right, guys, so for the Marvel collection from Adidas, you know, a little warm-up, would you say cop or drop? You say cop. I say they did these right, so these are the cop. Okay, okay. Let's move on to the next sneaker. All right, so next sneaker up is another batch of sneakers, but there's only really one worth talking about, I would okay. say, which are the Adidas Continentals collaborating with Childish Gambino. Mm. Oh, I saw Donald a little Glover. promo video yeah, for Yeah, yeah, so, okay. right. I don't Bam. Have to see the shoe, Let me know. 100 bucks, a little bit distressed, off-white. You see the laces and everything. What do you guys think about this? I got your name written all over it. $100 for some Adidas, <laughs> some classic-looking Adidas. They got distressed and all of it, a little off-white. Uh, that don't got Richie name written all over this, it. I don't this know, This not man. the right type of distress. This is just know. looks like strings hanging out. You know what for I mean? For sure, for sure. I, I'm really particular about my distressing. But you, know you know expect I mean? a, a rugged look from Donald Glover, though. Look at the ruggedness. It's not right, though. Yeah, it looks like a string. Can you see, you see what I'm saying? I gotta agree with Richie on this one. When it comes to distressing, it almost looks like defects. Defects, yeah. It almost <laughs> looks like it's a bunch of defects right here, loose strings, and yeah, I, I would wanna see, you know, just better distressing and the off white. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit too, uh, yeah, well, it almost looks too aged. Yeah, yeah. For, uh, for, uh, for a wrong reason. That is a hundred dollars. <laughs> for me personally, I like the shoe. I just don't like too much of the strings like you guys are saying out there. I do think the white looks straight though. You I don't can, know what you, you guys talking about. You can cut them a little bit. Of them. I, I might, I might, I might, I might yeah. cut them a little but, bit. But you know, those, those type of shoes are type of shoe where, you know, a fat foot can't put their foot in there. You know? oh, Guy like okay. Childish, Big Boy Johnny, there's just, you okay, know. Fit. All right guys, so for a hundred bucks, Adidas Continental collaboration with Childish Gambino, AKA Don, Donald Glover, yay or nay? Yay. Yay? For $100, it's still a drop for me. Yay. Yay. These, these are a drop. These are a drop for me. I would say... <sighs> Come on, man. 
Come on, man. Let's be real. $100. When's the last time you got a collaboration bucks. for 100 bucks? $100. Bucks, they're not bad. I would say, I would say cop. We're talking 100 bucks. There's not a lot of sneakers for 100 bucks. You nowadays. might be able to get a little friends and family. I think the retail for these you know? Continentals are usually like around $80, $90 anyways. So I guess for another extra $10, see what you guys are coming yeah. from. Yeah. All right, guys. We're saying cop for the Adidas Continentals. All right. So next sneaker up, this is part of like a whole collection with Fear of God. Nike, all right? They are now dropping their spring, yeah. summer Come debut. On, man. We talking about Come on, man. Give him a shot. Man. Well, are on, you man. treating Jerry like he Kanye right now, man? Come know, on now. Okay. So we'll kind of treat this like we do with the Supreme. We'll look through it. Let me know if there's a uh, cop or drop, something that catches your eye. Okay. Off the bat, this round of clothing looks better than the debut of the Nike clothing. I was I just going to say. That. I do agree with that. They do look very similar because of the fabric. If it's anything, Jerry Lorenzo knows how to just recycle that fabric and just come out, kind of come out with a whole new set of pieces yeah. with the same fabric. Do you think a shirt like this with just the FG for 300 bucks, what, what, what are your thoughts on that? When, <laughs> let's let's just say that hype beast come in all shapes and sizes, baby. That's <laughs> gonna get bought. Yeah. I, just, I just know it's gonna get bought. Very I true. don't like the, the whole initial like FG. It, I, I think a field goal. <laughs> field goal, <laughs> goal or okay. something like that, you know. When, FG when don't FG. even look good together. Fear of God yeah, yeah. just looks better than FG, yes. in my so opinion. True. Yeah. It needs to, uh, in my opinion, brand more of that script. Yeah, uh, the script with the, the Nike. The Nike Air. That would be sick. Air Fear of God. Air Fear of God. Like, he needs to yeah. kind of promote more of that. Yeah. I see what you're saying. I think Fear of God as a brand is yeah. probably one of the best at making their clothes look dope. Okay. But when you actually see it in person, it doesn't fit anything like it's very Their particular, campaigns. right? They, though the angles, the you're, way that you're, you're singing, the way the the way the, the the clothes sit on the the model. Yes. Let's say they pick might not look right on you. That jacket right there, I've seen it on other people. It looks like it crops to the belly button. That's crazy. But in this photo, would you say it looks dope? For sure. They so just picked the right models, man. Keep that in mind. Keep that in mind, guys. I'm not gonna lie. With this entire campaign, there are a couple pieces yeah. I like. Like, like that. The hoodie, like with the, the, with the, the little... hoodie with the jacket lid. That's a fire combination. Yeah. All right, guys. So for the Nike Spring Summer Campaign, Copper Drop. I'm going to say... Uh... And don't slip on the green ones. I didn't like those at first. That picture looked tight. I'm not going to front. That with picture the gray? Tight. You definitely need that type of outfit, though. You need Something a specific super outfit. Neutral, yeah. Yeah. almost balance out just the craziness of the color. That's a good point but, but... because uh, the, I like the Fear God ones because they look dope with so many different outfits. Yep. They're so versatile. Yeah. These... Very particular, you know definitely what I mean? All right, cop or drop? I'm gonna say this whole collection definitely is a cop. Yeah. It's a cop. Yeah, it's a cop. Buddy, from the, from yeah, even buddy. though the clothing yeah, looks similar, buddy. he did it better. He the did it whole better. The whole collection's a cop. The whole collection's a cop. Wow. I'm gonna say 80%. At least 80%. I was gonna say, I like a few pieces, but this is ultimately a drop for me. Wow, Ooh, okay, I would, on, say, I would say cop. I think he Hi, improved. Beast McGee's over I here. think he improved highly from the last collection, all right? For sure. And just because we're saying cop does not mean we're Jerry boys, all right? I, yeah. I, okay. You guys can't even put us in that category. In my opinion, I think the Jerry boys are more of the, uh, what, what year was that? The year where everyone just kind of looked like everyone. Yeah. This one is more of like, it's 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 athleisure. Jerry boys don't have athleisure Ooh, taste. That's a good we point. Jerry Damn. did a 180 on them, I yeah, feel like. Yeah, I feel like. They, 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 whole they never picked up a basketball, you know what <laughs> exactly. I mean? They, 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 they see this campaign, they get scared. Yeah. They get scared. They're like, do I, have I, I don't even go that way. That's why I like this, yeah. you know what I mean? First, I have I to get some of this Nike stuff. All right, yeah. guys, we are saying cop for the oh, Nike cop. Spring Summer uh, campaign. All right, so next sneakers up. We got two of them dropping on the same date, May 25th, all right? Okay. The last time we seen something similar to this was over five years ago, 2014, for the Lance Mountain SB's Jordan 1s. You guys remember ago. this? Yeah, I yeah. do. With the whole oil effect, so they are dropping two iterations of that again. Wow. Okay. Bam! Okay. So you got the Laker colorway right here. This right here, when you, uh, you know, rub it down, I haven't even really seen how to do it, mm -hmm. but once you rub it down, it does turn to a Bulls colorway to signify what? that uh, rivalry. Mm -hmm. And crazy. then this one turns into a hyper pink. In my opinion, I feel like it didn't have to be an SB. Mm -hmm. I think they're kind of following up with the Lance Mountain, the whole DIY experience with the shoe. In my opinion, I think they should just need to stop doing that. <laughs> just keep it a one just, or just the whole oil thing? Just the whole oil thing. It's just fun keep it, though, it's fun. Keep it one colorway. Fun, funness, fun. fun. Really? It's fun. It's a lot of work. So uh, basically I was doing a little research. In 2014, they came out with the SB1 For sure. to pay homage of how much skateboarders used to rock Jordan 1s yep. in the 80s. For skating. Because it yep. did have such, you know, materials that protected their feet yeah. and everything. Okay. This wasn't really offered back in the 80s. Okay. And so a lot of skateboarders wore Jordan 1s and now, 
They're trying to pay. You know, I like, keep forgetting that. I keep forgetting the reasoning. I, I <laughs> the keep reasoning. forgetting the reasoning, and them just. I do remember really, really OG pictures of skateboard in OG one. Yeah, kind of yeah. cool. So they like that, you know. You know the whole Laker colorway. Maybe I'm not feeling. Okay. Yes. You know what I mean. So maybe the whole oil thing. I think it is a good idea because you could just erase that colorway <laughs> and turn uh, it into like a Chicago Bulls. Turn, yeah, yeah. Type of colorway. You want me to show you? Let's do it. So this one, he did the complete rub down. Yeah. Okay. Does this change your opinion? It does not. I've never been a fan of Laker colorway sneakers. I agree, mm. I agree. I feel like with the light bone ones, it could just naturally fade into that hyper pink. You okay. don't gotta do the whole hyper pink. A little random, but you know, one thing I think uh, should have implemented this whole like distress scene with the oil and everything. Mm -hmm. What's that? Is the uh, Nigel Sylvester's. Yeah. Cause to me, those look a little bit too like worn and I everything. If the they would have did a dope colorway for his, make this, I think that would have been a cool collaboration. They should have did that. All right, guys. So for the SB Jordan ones dropping at the end of May, yay or nay? Some people are really excited about. I'm gonna say a hard nay. Hard nay? I'm, I'm gonna say uh, a, these are definitely a drop for me right okay, here. Okay, man. Don't don't make uh, a couple months from. Uh, I don't want to replay this. Look, look, look. Say, I, I'm done with the old DIY, man. I had to act and impress those, and you know what I was telling you. I try to take the, the oh, checkers off and the highlighter what? ones. Yeah, that, that didn't work. It was way too hard it to just, take that it was off. Way huh? too hard. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming these are a little easier, but still it's not gonna, uh, still these are drop. All right guys, so for the uh, Nike SB Jordan ones dropping at the end of May, we are all saying drop. Drop. All saying drop. All right, so next sneaker, we got another Jordan sneaker okay. in collaboration with the brand Pata, Ooh. a sneaker boutique out of Amsterdam, all right? So a lot of people are really excited about yeah, these, all right? Sure. Usually uh, collaborations with Nike and Pata is usually pretty hot. Usually yeah. pretty good, yeah. usually. All right, let me know. Usually. Usually. <laughs> no. So we got a pair of Jordan 7s right here. I don't even know what color I'm seeing. <laughs> like, this uh, is tiramisu. This is tiramisu. You got a little, bit of, tiramisu. a little bit of light brown, dark brown, a little, cherry and a little on top. bit of like a cherry red. <laughs> you know those collaborations where Nike and Jordan brand basically was like, hey, you want to collab, then we got a Jordan 7 left. You know what I mean? Uh, you, want, you want the 7s? Leftover collab? Yeah, leftover uh, collab. And this ain't no. a 1, this ain't a 4. Like, like a I, 7 I, might I, be the worst. Like, what does the 7 have to do with Pata, right? Very Jordan 7s. Yeah, you're right. Man, shout out to Pata, but this is a terrible collab. Very disappointed. I gotta agree with John. This one's a drop for me. Yeah, I saw a complex sneakers post. The excitement is real for these. I was like, that's the best caption you Complex got with excitement in You know man. what, though? I feel like in, uh, in uh, Amsterdam, they have a really, really big fan base, and I, I would not be surprised if there's lines for oh, days. Oh, for sure. No, yeah. they, they they don't care what collaboration All right, is. we're all saying drop for the Pata Jordan 7s. All right, so coming down to the wire, we got another Jordan dropping in August okay, okay. 3rd. 190 bucks. These came out probably over, that to be over 10 years ago. Oh, so it's a retro retro. Yeah, yeah. Right. Bam! Let me Yo. know, August 3rd, 190 bucks. These right here, Probably one of my favorite non-OG. No. I don't go oh, say. Back in the day, don't say you like these. Back in the day, don't say you like these. No, 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 I'm saying now. No, no now. You switch it up. Yeah, no, you, you, don't like even, you don't even know what you. Wait, 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 how am I mean? supposed to answer this know, right now? <laughs> no, no, no. Back in the day, what's crazy was I, I, I didn't that too. like. I thought that too. No, no. Back in the day, I didn't like that. They they threw in the yellow. I thought they threw oh, in the yellow yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh man, this shoe right here, I like. They, they don't even have to have Nike here in the back. Oh, well, but they never came out with the back. Yeah, no, you know no, what I mean? Oh, you're saying like it doesn't even need that branding. For sure, it's cool. I like it. These are definitely. 14 pairs. 14 pairs? 14 pairs. I'm waiting on 14 pairs. Okay, 14, 14 pairs. 14 pairs, wow. man. That's a heavy statement. It's, it's a good neutral shoe. You could rock this with any of your outfit. It kind of go, the, come on, you guys. Just think about it. Think about it. You guys think are really off it. this. <laughs> I can see these are some camel pants. Right? <laughs> yeah. Might be a little fire. <laughs> Might be a little fire. I'm saying it's a cool shoe. Right now, right now you gonna flip flop right now? It's I'm looking at your camel you pants right now. Flip flop again like, hey, you right um, now. Richie Lee collects your samples uh, right here. Yeah, I'm just gonna say. Samples. I'm excited for these right and here. And I was like, trying to think of an outfit. This guy. And, I, and I've seen like what Travis Scott rocked these recently. Very clean. <sighs> Yo, I'm on it. I'm on it. High beast follow high beast. I'm with it, man. I'm with it. You know, these I'm are trying, dope. I'm trying to have a unique opinion. That a flip flop bit. didn't even take long for you to flip flop. It's I saw easy. the pants, bro. The pants, the pants. The pants. Yeah. All right, guys. Uh, but yeah, the bread fours. I am excited for fours in general. I'm I'm excited for. Oh yeah, fours in general. Would right? you say we're kind of off the threes? 
Threes, man, for some reason, I, I am. I got to agree. I, yeah. think, I think nope. the Father Assad ones nope, is kind of... Nope, nope, nope. Kind of uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm saying, yeah, I'm a little off threes, man. I'm a I'm little always, off threes. I'm always going to be rocking threes till I die. These used to be the grails, and now they don't even give me that feeling anymore. Till I die. <laughs> All right, guys, you let's ugly. move on to the last sneaker. All right, so last but not least, Johnny, I know you've been pretty excited about these. What we got? What we got? The 3.0. Ah! of the shattered backboards. Wow. Don't get me started. Bam. Let me know with the OG Ooh. color blocking. We talked about these. It was rumored that they would be patented leather. Mm. Now not patented oh, leather. I'm so happy. October. What do you guys think? <laughs> this is the, one of the first shoes that I would say non-OG colorway. Uh -huh. I don't even like orange. Yeah. I always, well, we've, we've always said we don't like really Halloween colorways. Yeah. The, the prices of the first ones, Bananas, over these ones, banana tree. Over banana tree, the whole tree. This is gonna be, I I, might I don't even know what that means, but I know what that means. It's that just gonna, gonna be worth a, a lot more. It's gonna be, a whole it's gonna be a lot worth a lot more. Yeah, I was reading in the notes, the midsole will not be white. It's gonna be an off so that's white. Yeah. I mean, you, you don't even see anything close to this colorway. Yep. As simple as it is, black and orange, you never really seen anything in the past that Jordan released with Jordan 1 that's similar to this. Mm -hmm. I'm, gonna know, call, I'm gonna call these the young OGs, because they should be an OG colorway. I agree. I agree. Oh, All right, I so uh, very excited about these. Yo. The three .0s, I'm sure we're gonna bring these up when our official photos release and everything. Yeah. October fourth. You know, mm. Halloween, Halloween, vibe, Halloween. Halloween vibes. <laughs> it's only right. Yo. Trick or treat. That's fine. That's fine with me. These with the camel pants might be so I'm, I'm saying. I'm Five saying. Two. That pretty much wraps it up for the cop or drop on upcoming sneaker releases. Let us know if you agree or disagree. Shout out to Sky for coming back from doggy vacation. Make sure you guys check out Tan's Instagram. Check out Johnny's Instagram. And until next time, we out. Peace. Peace. All right, guys, thank you for checking out that video. Make sure you guys check out this video. Also, check out this video. Let us know down in the comments below what you guys plan on getting. What was your favorite sneaker? Let us know if we're tripping on any of these decisions or opinions. And that's pretty much it. And until next time, we out. Peace.